Previously on It's Apocalypse. Now we'll start the injection at the spot that is marked and well, we'll stop. And there are zombies running around outside on the Ithaca College campus. Mina! <laughs> we need to go now or we may never find her. Striker, where are we going? Hey, Striker. We're looking for someone. She was moving towards Dillingham. Follow me. <sighs> Mina! No, 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 Mina. You know what has to be done. If no communication is made within 24 hours, all life forms will be eliminated. This is unacceptable. Containment of this size isn't an option. It's simply not plausible. Our job is to do what isn't plausible. If a contagion of this size was to ever be released, the United States military would be unable to pick and choose which civilians to save and which to keep in the quarantined area. I refuse to let healthy civilians be kept in a contaminated area. <sighs> then we would have to analyze and decontaminate everyone in the area. That's the only solution. So we make another solution. So help me God. What? There's my girl. Hey, Dad. Or Colonel, I guess. I expect improvements in the morning. Yes, sir. How's the tour? Seems like a nice place. Kind of in the middle of nowhere, though. That's a traditional university for you. What's all this for? Possible contagion containment plans. Did something happen? No, but it never hurts to have a plan. Still on for lunch? Yeah, I'm starving. Sure. Mm, military only. <laughs> Whatever. It's not like you're ever gonna need them anyway. They can't possibly be serious. They are. They want us to transmit a radio signal? Why not give us a phone number or something? Well, all our cell phones are dead. What good will it do? Who even has a radio transmitter on campus? Park? Look, guys, this is an interesting development all, but can we please attack things in order? Lily, cure. There is no cure. Know. Maybe. Duncan. Duncan hadn't seen a single zombie. Yeah, he was locked in that room. We were locked in a room too, and we didn't have much luck either. Something was protecting him. Well, you know, Domino's is magic. No, no, I'm serious. You remember that smell? It, it, was pro it probably had something to do with the body spray. This is irrelevant. No, it isn't. I did see a lot of those cans around. Could that be it? I mean, it could be a deterrent. It's worth a try. Anything is. <gasps> Body spray is not a cure. This is ridiculous. Adam, you are not taking this thing all the way across campus to slap on some body spray. You are staying with us and you are staying alive. End of discussion. You don't give me orders, Stryker. The only thing I care about is keeping her alive. If she's not with me, then I don't care about getting she's off this not campus. She's with you. Yes. Adam, she is dead. No, she's not. I'm going to find Duncan. Who's with me? Fine. Come on. Adam. You're an idiot. Good luck. You too. We'll be in park, so you know. I don't want to get in between anything here, but we need to move somewhere safe. We're not going to park right now. There's no way I'm going outside at night. The announcement said we had 24 hours. Let's just prep here tonight and we'll set out at dawn. You said you have a base here? 
We crash? Stryker, you of all people don't have to ask. Thank you. <coughs> right, um, lead the way. Name and purpose. Open the door, Elise. <sighs> Jesus, Quentin. Good to see you, too. Yeah. Who are these people? Friends. You. I know you. No, you don't. Yes, I do. Oh, my God. <gasps> Whoa. You, this is your fault. All of this is your fault. Let her go. Do you know what this girl did? This thing is just as bad as all the rest of those zombies out there. She's the reason they're out there. What? I know. You, you knew? knew? Don't you think I know everything about the people I surround myself with? But Stop it! I'm sorry. It was an accident. I didn't mean to, but I... I'm so, so sorry. If I could take any of it back, I would, but I... I didn't know what I was doing! Nobody blames you. I do. I said let her go. You're scum. Maybe you should stay here and guard the door. Look, all right, Mina. Mina, I'm sorry. I have to do this. I assume you heard the announcement? Yeah. We're screwed. No, we're not. We just need to get to park. Because everything in Ithaca revolves around the park school. Well, actually. We need a plan. Park is all the way on the other side of campus. We need to find a way to get there as strategically as possible. The body spray. Irrelevant. No, it isn't. Duncan went five days without running into a single zombie, and he smelled of it. Coincidence. Would you just listen to me? Before we met you, we ran into these bodies, and they smelled exactly like the body spray, and there weren't any zombies anywhere around. Lily, is this possible? Well, Adam is blinded by his desire to save Mina, but I've been thinking about Duncan also. I was telling Nick how the infected can't do anything a human can't logically do, because we have the same basic biology, but the virus could create conditions where certain stimuli would gross an exaggerated reaction. Sorry, biology major mode. Basically, the infected don't really have any superhuman senses, but that doesn't mean they don't respond differently. Like, when a woman is pregnant, the foods she normally loves might taste or smell repulsive to her. The same could be true for the zombies and the body spray. The bodies? What? If the bodies have the body spray, the zombies would be repulsed by them, and then they would stay away. It's likely. It's a repellent. Great, but we still don't have the body spray. Actually, I might have some. Oh, not happening. We're gonna have to wait them out. I'm sorry. Wait in here. Please, please just try to sleep. Uh, I, I think your definition of some is off. Of all the things you could have grabbed from your room during a zombie apocalypse, you chose that? Well, it's got pheromones in it and stuff. You know, to make girls like you. This is the worst time to have a crush on someone. There aren't even any girls around to impress. Uh, 
Uh, so we could just spray on ourselves and go outside? Most likely. Guess it really is that easy. Okay, so sunrise and then we're heading out. Hey, Stryker, keep watch with me? <laughs> you should get some sleep. I don't sleep that much anymore. Well, then I guess it's just the two of us. Just like the old days. Mm -hmm. Party at Ashley's. <sighs> don't remind me. <laughs> Good night. Ith Apocalypse is brought to you by Domino's Pizza. <coughs> <coughs> All right, everyone ready to move out? Yeah. Yeah. So, how do you think Adam and Nina are doing? Hey! Let's go! So, you and Quentin are really close. I guess so. How do you two know each other? We've had several sex-packed, passionate nights. Kidding. <sighs> kind of. Oh. I do have a sense of humor, believe it or not. Yeah, I sort of figured you did. I've just never really seen it. You haven't been paying attention. I don't really think that's it. You should be quiet. Don't worry, Quentin's taking care of them. Why do you always have to be so uptight? Oh, so saving your ass is being uptight now? No, oh, calm down. That's not what I meant. You know what, Nick? How about you mind your own business and go back to hiding behind your camera? And the next time that I have to save your ass, again, don't even open your mouth. Mina, Mina, come here. Mina, please. Mina, Mina, listen, listen, I'm gonna fix you. But first we need to get over there, and then I can make you better. Mina, Mina. Do you remember me? Yeah, yeah, I remember you. Uh, where are those other guys? I don't know, I think they went to park or something. Can I have your body spray? Yeah, how'd you know that? What is that? This is my girlfriend, Mina. Oh, what's up? Ah! Body spray! Yeah, sure. Here. I'm just gonna go in the corner. This is gonna make you better. Okay, here goes. Dude! I think it's working. How much more do you think I have to do this? I have no idea, bro. Just kick it in, Quentin. Well, Nick, you're the pseudo parky. Turn it on. I'm not pseudo anything. It's off. What do you mean, it's off? I said the power is off and I can't turn it on. I don't, I don't even know how to turn on the electricity in this frickin' building. I, I don't know how to contact the military. I do. I know circuit boards. Well, I'll go with you. No. Stryker, can I have your gun? Um, it's time I finish what I started. It's working. Mina, Duncan, it's working. Mina, Mina. Nice one, bro. <laughs> Thank you.
guys, this is the moment that we'll remember for the rest of our lives. Yeah, let's hope it's a long one. Uh, hello? Um, hello, my name is Nick Whitefall. I'm a current student at Ithaca College. I'm, I'm trying to contact the U.S. military. Hello? Hello? This is Colonel Jameson of the United States military. Uh, Colonel, this is Stryker. Is my father there? Stryker? Oh god, no. Your father isn't here, but I'll tell him you're all right. How many are you with? Five. What about Lily? There are five of us. Can you get to the park school? We're already here. Can you get to the delivery bay? Uh, yeah, not a problem. Fifteen minutes, Stryker. But hurry, we're gassing the campus within the hour. This will be your last chance to get out. You got it, Colonel. There are six of us, Stryker. What the hell is wrong with you? Lily specifically asked for my gun. So what's that supposed to mean? She knew it was empty. Ith Apocalypse is brought to you by Domino's Pizza. Oh, this place is dead. Well, let's hope it stays that way. I hope this isn't what you meant by dead. Okay, guys. Just keep fighting no matter what. We're so close. It's about time we had a fight like this. Nick, Stryker, double back and go around the other side. Consider us already there. Whoa. Before. Not the time, Nick! Well, this is our last moment together. I think this is the perfect time! Just don't uh, get yourself killed! I can take care of myself! I don't see why I have to be so uptight about everything! I... Don't give me that crap! I'm saving our lives! I know that! You just need to calm the hell down! We're in the middle of a zombie apocalypse. I really don't think calming down is the solution! Well, sorry for making a suggestion! Why don't you shut the hell up? Why don't you just get your stupid boyfriend so you have to hear me talk? Ugh! Boyfriend? What are you talking about, Quentin? Obviously! Oh, oh my god, you dated my brother in high school. Wait, what? Uh, why would I make that up? Why do you even care? I want you to like me! I like you plenty. Happy now? No idea. Elise, you need to run! I'm not leaving without you! And I'm not leaving without you. How about you both leave? I'll hold them off for as long as I can. Just go! We're not leaving you behind, Quentin. We're in this together. We have to go back. Oh yeah, Kate, that makes sense. <laughs> oh wait, I just remember we're not from Lost. No, listen. We maybe have like five minutes left. If there are other survivors out there, they could make it in time. We have to let people know. Striker, that's crazy. We're not doing that. How about now? Yeah, okay, let's go. Um, attention, attention everyone, my name is Nick Whitefall, and I'm a current, well, not so current, I guess, a IC student, I'm, and I'm a survivor. If anyone, anyone is on campus, please report to the park delivery bay as soon as possible. The military is coming, they're here to save as many people as they can, so please, please hurry. Are you ready? We don't have any weapons. Oh, that's a drag. We're just gonna have to rank a run for it. Okay. You ready? Ready. One, two... Whoa! Where's Quentin? Quentin, let's the stairs! Should we just stop in the thinking of this? It's still going to be working on anything anyway. Why is it
Dad, this is Nick. We gotta get going. Right. Are we the only ones left? I'm glad you're okay, Ashley. Me too. Ashley. Next time on Ithapocalypse, nothing, everyone's dead.